Today we're going to learn about Destiny Discover, a wonderful app to use on multiple devices. You click on the Discover app icon down at the bottom. Once you open the app, you'll see a screen that says our school's name, Franz Elementary, right there in the middle. If you don't see our school's name, it's very easy to get to. All you have to do is click on the Any Location drop-down menu, find Texas, because that's what state we live in, scroll all the way down to the T's, and then once you select Texas, you start typing in our school's name, Friends Elementary. Once you start typing, some options will come down below. We're going to select the one that says Friends Elementary School, Katy, Texas, not the one in San Antonio. Now you have the option to browse as guest or log in. We're going to log in. Your username and password is the usual KDISD ID and password that you use for KD Cloud and other logins for the district, including iStation. If you don't know what this login information is, please ask your teacher for more information. Once you've entered your username and password, click on the Submit button. It's the blue button right next to Cancel. Once you've clicked the Submit button, it will bring you to the home screen for Destiny Discover. Once at the home screen, you can select Search, the Search button, to search for books using key terms or author's name or even title. You can also click on the ebooks button to bring up all the ebooks that we have in our collection, or the audiobooks button to select all the audiobooks in our collection. We're going to select the search button and type in Minecraft. Now we have all the books in our collection have Minecraft either in the title or in the description. We're going to look at all the books that we have on the shelves that have something to do with Minecraft by selecting the See All button. As you can see, many of them are checked out because they have the red Out tag on the top left hand corner of each cover. Even though they're out, you can still add them to your reading list by clicking the Favorites button. This will add it to your Favorites list that you can pull up under your book bag at the top. Let me show you again with another book. I click on the favorites button. When I click on the favorites button, it'll start thinking and it'll say favorite added. And now the favorites button is replaced by remove favorite. You can now access your favorites by going to the book bag at the top and selecting favorites. Here are all the favorites that I have in my favorites list. This is like creating your own reading list. From here, you can open ebooks from your favorites list by clicking the green open button and then clicking open again. Once the book loads, you can click the start button to have it read to you. Once you're finished with your ebook, you can click on the discover button on the top left hand corner to return to the Discover app. Once you get back to the favorites list, you can remove them by clicking the Remove Favorite button. Or you can open up another ebook. If there's another ebook in your list, you can click on it and open it. At the home screen, if you want to open up just ebooks, you can click on the ebooks button. This will bring up a list of most of the ebooks that we have in our collection. To open them, all you need to do is click one of the green open buttons, and it should open right in your screen. To return to the main menu, click on the Discover button on the top left hand corner. This will return you to your previous screen where you were in Destiny Discover. Then you can go to the main home screen 
And if you like, you can select something else. For example, if you wanted to browse by a topic, you can select a topic under the Browse by Topic section. You can select Graphic Novels. And if you select Graphic Novels, it will pull up all the books in our library that are graphic novels, both books that you could find on the shelf and our ebooks. Let's look at the books that we can find on our shelf first. If you notice, a lot of these books have something in common. That call number, the address of the book where you can find it, is very similar for every single one of these. Every single one of them should be 741.5 and then there should be three letters afterwards. Sometimes there might be uh, an abbreviation of paperback in front of it, but most all of them are the same, 741.5. That section of our library is the library section for our graphic books, our comic books, and other graphic novels. Remember, to access your favorites list, you need to go to the book bag and then select favorites. This will bring up all of your favorites that you added to your reading list. In your book bag, you can also select checkouts to find out which items you have checked out in your account. This will pull up all the books that you have checked out from our library. When you're finished, click on log out next to your name at the top. This will log you off of the device. Do this anytime you're finished with an iPad or a computer and you have logged in. This will make sure that only you have access to your information. You should see this screen when you're done logging out.